Still, yeah, today I'm a staunch non-berserker. Okay. Dude! Dude! <laughs> what, what, what is the point of Didn't giving a check? Memo. Didn't get the memo! <laughs> 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 uh, to F8, uh, G8. I, I, I mean, I'm not saying it's a bad move. I'm just saying it's a uh, it's a really stupid move. Yeah, it's probably a very decent move. Um, but I I have gotten what I wanted here. Probably no, yeah, I mean watching the the stream. Oh, yeah, probably not needed because Princeton somehow removed all of his rooks away. <laughs> and that lost. was a, a nice touch and like. lost on time. Yeah. So yeah, Winston managed to actually lose this position on the board somehow because rook g6. He could have, if he saw that rook g6 was played, he could have taken on g6 and taken on a5 and at least guarantee a draw. But instead, he pre-moved all of these moves, and uh, yeah, <laughs> not great, not great. Dubov actually won that game against Alan Pichot. Uh, Grishuk Gwen Jones was a draw. Ajiban beat Simon. Bastante bien. Y mira, se está, se está partiendo, ¿no? Se está directamente partiendo. Y, y Magnus también, ¿no? Se están riendo los dos, ¿no? Magnus yo creo que también se está riendo, lo que pasa es que se tapa. Pero mira, 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 se están partiendo los dos. Eh, ¿Qué está pasando? ¿Qué está pasando? Que se están partiendo, no sé, ha debido pasar algo. So, I mean, he keeps on laughing, and it, I think it's quite nice to see. Fort, uh, and I, you know, for me, with the White King Castle, that's like a bit of a red rag. It's like, okay. Because his pawns are pointing this way, and White plays on the queen side, and you should keep it right on the B6 square. Yeah, um, let's talk about the pieces right now while Magnus chuckles to himself. Put a rook on the open file next and just line them up against Black's king. So it plays itself. Yeah. It does. And, uh, Dubov's smiling because he knows he's he's tricked Dubov. He's surprised him. Is that why we're, why we're seeing Magnus Carlsen with a smile, a grin on his face there? <laughs> he just tricked him. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Why is Magnus Carlsen having a huge laugh here, David? <laughs> uh, I mean, unless he's listening to us, I'm not sure, Kaya. Remember, he laughed the other day and we asked him and he couldn't remember why he was yeah, laughing. Well, this is a bigger laugh. Uh -huh, then. This is the reason why you can see, uh, you know, he's turning Dubov's philosophy against himself. Do you remember Dubov, fa Dubov fa famously said, when my pieces are attacked, I counterattack. And uh, here it goes. So Magn he's back at it, Magnus again. has attacked the queen. <laughs> <laughs> and it's, it's an internal There you go, you can see it. Chess is uh, funny. <laughs> the computer's in this position it. three moves in advance already, but he looked even further. He pushes his pawn forward, attacking the black queen, and no matter where the black queen goes, say it retreats. Um, both the white's pieces are attacked, the bishop and this knight, but, <laughs> <laughs> but Magnus... Maybe the reason he's laughing is because he can save one of his pieces. He can drop his bishop back um, and now attacking, counter-attacking the black knight. So when his own knight drops, he wins the black knight and white comes out with an extra pawn. Genius by Magnus Carlsen. And he's loving this. Yeah, this he's is turning fantastic. looks like that suddenly... Uh... Wow. About his own blunder earlier, but also shocked that <laughs> now he's smiling. There we have it. <laughs> but he's also shocked that Wesley 